Hello everybody, so today I will talk about geometry. The question in here is about finding the area of the red triangle in here. So we have three circles and one equilateral triangle in here. So I will show you the technique how to answer the question. First, we need to sketch three lines in here. Because this is about equilateral, the central in here is about the circumscribed of the circle in here. This I want to find the length of from the center to the point of the equilateral. So we need to apply the formula of circumscribed circle. We have A multiplied with B multiplied with C. A, B, C is, are the plane of this triangle in here. Divide by 4 S equal to R to find the value of S in here we have the formula that's it about S equal to 1 over 2 multiply with number 4 multiply with number 4 and we have multiply with side 60 degrees we got about 4 multiply with the square root of number 3 so we have ABC is about 4 multiply with 4 multiply with 4 divide to 4 multiply with the square root of number 3 and we got about the value in here Oh, we have number 4 in here too. So you got about 4 multiplied with the square root of number 3 over 3. So we just find the circumscribed circle of this equilateral triangle in here. We know that the land form the length from the intersection between the red triangle to the blue circle that's the about number 2 because that's the about radius so we can calculate from the center to the red triangle length in here we need to use about this number minus number 2 next I just draw another triangle in here. After we calculate this number in here, we just found the number for this triangle. This number that should be about this length in here. Because the red triangle is about equilateral, so the angle in here we know that should be about 60 degrees this one is about a right triangle so to calculate to calculate the plane in here I use is about L so we have 60 degrees and we have the value in here we will do about 10 60 degrees we have L divide to this number we just calculate that's about 4 multiplied with square root number 3 over 3 minus 2 so we calculate about L in here we use tan 60 degree multiply with the number in here. You got about 4 
minus 2 multiplied with the square root of number 3. After we calculate about the length in here, we can find the area of this triangle in here. So that should be S equal to this number multiply with this number divide by 2 so we got the answer in here that should be about 14 multiply with the square root of number 3 minus 24 over 3 now go back to the figure in here if we draw the line in here we have one Two, three, four, five, and six. So we have six triangle in here. They have the same area, just one triangle in here. In this situation, we need to multiply with number six, and we can get about twenty-eight. Multiply with the square root of number 3 minus 48. And this is the number we need to find in here. That's it, the end. Thank you for watching.